Wix responsive screen size creating responsive website on Wix. Hello guys, Celia here and in this video I'm going to show you how can we easily create responsive website using Wix website builder. So they provide us the opportunity to create them from scratch or we can easily customize their template. So here we are on Wix.com. Let's click on get started in the right top corner. And we can create an account using email or Gmail or Facebook. I'm going to continue with Gmail as for me this is the easiest variant. And we'll come to our homepage where we can manage all of our sites. So in order to create a new site I'm going to click on plus create new site. And we'll come to our page with templates but before we need to answer for some of the questions we can easily skip it in the right bottom corner. I'm going to skip all the questions because we can easily uh, change everything we need after like choosing template. So here we are. I suggest you to click on begin with template. These like um, blue text. So let's click and we'll come to our templates area where we can find a lot of different templates. We can just simply click on all templates and we'll find we'll discover all the templates they provide. It's like 73 pages of different templates at least like maybe a few hundred templates right up here we can also use the blank templates as you can see it looks like this so we can easily add our information and after that start creating or we can create it from scratch so basically um, before starting i wanted to say that all the templates provided by vix are totally responsive so if you'll try to view some of the templates here we can easily switch between different devices in the top of the screen and as you can see this website is pretty good on desktop and also on the mobile and if you'll choose the another like template from maybe even from the other page for example this one here I'm going to click on view and if you'll uh, swipe between different devices we can see that it's totally responsive so it means that we can easily use uh, every single uh, like uh, template and it will be totally responsive and we don't have to like add some additional stuff. You can add the elements, you can customize and all of them will be successfully automatically optimized for different devices like desktop, laptop and mobile phone. And if you'll try to use like blank templates, we can also try to view how does it looks like for example for maybe like classic layout let's click on view and here we are it looks like this so as you can see there is like blank project with images text and so on and if we'll uh, switch between like devices we can see that this uh, like template is also optimized and so what does it mean it means that we can easily use every single blank template here and it will be also like optimized so uh, moreover if you'll come to for example this page let's click on edit and we'll come to our editor and a few seconds it may take a little time depends on our internet speed and the server's capacity so let's wait for a little uh, moreover if you will try to optimize for example if we need to like add this image here i'm just going to click click on like manage slides we can add different slides here for example we can easily click somewhere here uh, click on duplicate and new slides all of them will be totally responsive we can add for example images here we can we can simply click uh, click on change image and I'm going to find something from stock maybe let's try to find uh, let it be from homepage here uh, maybe I don't know let it be like this one here choose image so uh, all the changes will be successfully optimized as for the uh, other devices as you can see if you'll switch to the phone all was successfully adopted as for us and I think that it's pretty pretty cool if you'll go back to all the templates and we'll try to use for example this one here so i'm going to click on edit and also we'll come to my editor uh, we can customize every single part here all the text uh, images buttons and according to the changes they will be also optimized so let's try to add some section maybe about our team 
so let it be like this here now i'm going to move it down for a little also move it down and i'm going to add one more section about uh, contact page so from this page here i'm just going to add it here and i'm going to move it down down once more once more and let it be here and if you'll try to switch between different devices we can see how does it looks like on for example mobile phone so we can easily find that there is like the team it looks like this and as for me it's pretty cool and the page with how to find is also uh, is also responsive as for us so as you can see there is like hidden on mobile elements we can find how does it looks like for example column 2 uh, and column 2 was uh, hidden but we can also like make them non-hidden and now it looks like this so as you can see you can right click on an element to move it between the menu box header and footer it means that we can easily hide and unhide different elements and sometimes it could be really helpful to manage because on this page we can find some stuff which is suitable as for us and we needed to perform on mobile for example but for some reasons it's unavailable or it was automatically hidden so from this page you can remove it back to visible elements and as for me it's really really important so uh, when everything is done we can just simply click on publish in the right top corner i uh, use a free domain save and continue and in a few seconds basically everything is done we can just simply click on done and now we can view our site you can easily send this like link to your mobile phone and try to view it from mobile and i think it's pretty cool that there is like opportunity to I uh, use it even for free and it's totally responsive as I already said so in conclusion yeah uh, the website templates and the blank templates are totally responsive and it's not necessary so now we are on blank uh, like a uh, project and as you can see there is like also one element here a strip we can show and now it uh, all the elements from the website on desktop are available on mobile so uh, make sure that you uh, discover this folder and you'll manage all the features you want to show so yeah this is the way of how can we publish a responsive website on wix and how can we add different elements how can we make them visible or invisible on mobile version i hope guys this video helped you out if it is, please leave a like, comment and subscribe. If you have any questions, you can write them in the comments below. I'll try to answer. So that's all for this video. Hope you are doing great and I wish you a very good day. Goodbye.